What's up, y'all? This is Bobby Washington. Um, I just did a test in my car, um, testing the sound quality between a CD from this old player, right, that I got connected through this FM transmitter going through the radio um, on a channel, not Bluetooth, but it's similar to Bluetooth, um, into my stereo speakers. And I'm comparing that to the sound of the Bluetooth um, from my phone and also testing that from the sound of Spotify in here. And, I, and just like I thought, the sound on the CD is much bigger, much fuller. And I knew that because I'm a recording artist. This is actually my CD and I'm a producer. So I knew when I export stuff out for Spotify to be distributed for Apple, iTunes and all that stuff, we have to compress it very, very tiny to fit in your phones to be able to stream across the air. So you make, you're, you're cheapening something. You're taking away the width, the sides, also, some of the lows, some of the highs. You're shaving down a whole bunch to make this song fit. And in the process, you're losing quality. Now, back in the day, people really cared about quality. They bought their big systems in their cars, and they cared about the quality. Um, but nowadays, people are just kind of accepting what radio plays them. And since, you know, everybody's on, on MP3, okay, well, then everybody sounds tiny. So I'm, it doesn't matter. No, it does matter. If you really like big sound in your car, I, I tell you what, take, do it yourself. Get a CD. And go get the same song from YouTube or from or from Spotify and compare the sound yourself. It's like night and day. One is full and wide and surrounds your whole car. And one is just tiny, comes in the middle, like in the center of your forehead. It's very, very tiny. So don't allow them to take away the CD players. Don't allow them to take away the aux cords. Because without an aux cord, you can't plug in um, a CD player because they're not putting them in the, the, the dash. And they don't even have space for you to add one. They're actually <laughs> deliberately making it not possible so you can be forced into buying, you know, a satellite radio. They give you three months for free, but they make you pay after that. You know, and, and of course, the car companies get a kickback from satellite radio, you know, because they're making you buy their stuff because they don't allow you to have your own CD, which sounds better than their stuff. Okay? So people, check into it. If you uh, want to know how to connect your, your old CD player to your car, if you don't have an aux hole, there's a way to do that by getting this little gadget here. I'll have it in the bottom of the description. All you have to do is buy this gadget. It comes with this cord that plugs into the head jack of the um, CD player. It also plugs into like an old iPod. If I have an iPod full of songs. Um, I prefer a CD player, like I said, because it sounds better. But it is capable of doing that if you wanted to do that. But I love CDs. They sound better to me. I mean, I got thousands of them, and I'm glad I didn't get rid of them because, I, first of all, I own them. And if these companies decide to go away, Spotify decide to go away tomorrow, so does the songs that you bought in your catalog that, that you were renting. I own these. All right? This is your man, Bobby Washington. Peace.